so much money. Good turn. Yeah, money train. <laughs> Hang on, wait, I gotta click the button. Yeah. If I remember, that'll make a good thumbnail. <laughs> Hello, hello everybody, my name is Nuke, and welcome back to Super Mario 3D World. We're going into the World 4-4 now. We got halfway through World 4. If you remember in the last episode, I, uh, had a lot of stupid deaths in the last level. We're gonna try to avoid that this time. Also, I'm gonna switch back to Mario, because while Luigi's got the mad ups, he's a lot floatier, and I'm not quite used to handling him yet. Mario's just, uh... Very well balanced. Very easy to control, by comparison. Luigi's got a little more of that advanced player goodness going on with him. That was a very unfortunate place for that fire flower to be. Ah, coins. Cool. A quick look around here, see if there's any... Green stars or... Stamps. Does not appear to be, so I'll just take my... I'm just gonna take my way up. There we go. Okay. Oh. Nice. Oh, this level makes me slightly uncomfortable, I'm not gonna lie. Probably a good thing I didn't use Luigi on this level. Hmm. I think I can I think I can make this jump. I don't know if I can make this jump. I might need a cat suit, but I think I can make this jump. I gotta like time it right. Come on, Mario. Mario. Well, we were talking, talking junk about Luigi, this is probably a perfect level for him. Yeah, I can't make the jump, I just gotta time it. Mario! Stop j jumping off... To the, ...toward the stream. There we go. Good lord. Good god, man. There's people watching. <laughs> I can only blame so much of my incompetence on you. <laughs> okay, I'll just say if I mess up that one stupid jump. This is a moving bounce platform. Stamp is just somewhere along this this bounce platform here. There it is. We got it. we got it. Kind of held my breath for a second there because that just makes me gives me so much agita. Back off. Yeah. Love it when a level comes together. And yeah, that should give me the pipe to the mystery house. Oh, there's ten in this one. Okay. Mystery House Mad Dash. Ah. Yes, I'm familiar. You gotta just get to the end as fast as you can. Right. 
This one's actually kind of fun. All about the speed. Oh crap. Ah! And that's not disconcerting at all. I'm getting a lot of money out of this thing. How much money does this thing give me? Okay, there we go. Ah. Perfect time for it to pop off my head, I guess. It was a very precarious jump, <laughs> but we got it. Nice. I don't care what my clear score is. Go away. Some people do, but I am not one of those people. I passed 100 green stars. What do we have here? Uh, let me check this pipe before I go in that level. Fire bro here. Yeah. Yeah, this guy is just kind of... Scattered throughout the world, just these fire bro hideouts. As you can see, they're not super hard. Should unlock the stamp house, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Thank you for the stamp. Okay, this next level, I think it'll give me a cat suit because I need—I know I need—I know I need a cat suit for it. Like Lost City. This is actually like probably one of my favorite levels in the game, just for the aesthetic. I love like the Lost City ruins types of uh, types of level aesthetics. I don't know why, I just do. I always thought they were cool. Ah, yes, this. Let me get rid of these spikes. Get out of here. Making my life difficult. We don't need none of that. Free Cornage. Whoa. Yeah, I took that jump a little too close. We got it. Ain't nothing to it, yo. Good. I lost my cat bell in the process of getting another cat bell. Perfect. Right, yeah, this expenditure here is kind of kind of weird because because you have to go up on the control stick to go up the wall, but if you go off the wall, that moves you in a different direction entirely. It's a little odd.
All right. We just find the stamp. We've got all the stars now. How funny would it have been if I just said that and then just fell to my death without getting the star? <laughs> I didn't get the stamp. Well, fudge. I think last time I did that level, I lost the stamp too. We'll go, we'll go back in it. I'll do it one more time just to find the stamp. And then we'll do the castle. The level might, this episode might go a little longer, but... Ah, what the hey, right? Okay, I can get another cat suit anyway. Thank you. Take it a little bit slower, see if we can't keep our eyes peeled for the- Oh, it's right over here. <laughs> I always forget it's right over here. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and finish off the rest of this level. I'll be right back. Alright, we got it. Okay, now we can go on to the castle. Finish off World 4. I think I've got everything in World 4 so far. Double check the course list, just to make sure. Don't want to leave anything behind. Wrong button. Uh, yeah, just the castle. Okay, cool. About oh, 50 stars, yeah. I think I have that. When you have more than double the requisite stars, uh, I'd say you're probably doing pretty good. <laughs> All right, lava rock lair. And I will need your assistance, sir. No, I probably deserve that. That doesn't mean I'm happy that it happened. Hey, make a bell! A little quick on those jumps. I think there's stuff up here. Yeah, there's a stamp. Okay. This is not the first or last time an item will be up on the walls like that. Got it. Okay, this next star is kind of a interesting get. Yeah, I take the rock and yeet. I think this boss is the big boulder guy. Oh wait, a mushroom. I don't want it, but thank you. Big boulder guy. Oh yeah, you're so scary. Bro, you're a rock. You ain't scary. Come on. Come on, you ain't nothing. You ain't nothing but a wuss. Boom. I'm trying to leave that guy alive so I can have him. Whoa. 
Oh, this guy survived, so kind of solved that problem, didn't it? Worry, small tiny friend, I am coming to your aid. Just have to pose on the flagpole first. Alright. Another world done. And in good time, I must say. Wasn't expecting to take only two episodes for World 4. I think World 4 is just generally pretty short, though. You gonna build me a pipe? Pipe to the next world so I can continue saving your friends? That would be the smart thing to do. This green comes back because she just built like a giant laser cannon and just shoots me with it. <laughs> this is, as she screams, Oh, hell, Lord Bowser! <laughs> I don't know why, I think that'd be funny. Anyway. Alright, we are in the... I guess the undersea world? There's only one beach level this entire world, I think, so... I'm gonna call it that. <laughs> what have we got here? Let's take a look around. There's a mushroom house over there. Captain Toad back there. Any other pipes around here? Ah, there is. Yeah, when you see the little, like, stones that look like that, you can just walk up to them, press A, and they make a, make a new pipe. Ah, the fire, bro. Well, I'm already here. Let's well introduce ourselves. Oh, oh, this. Bruh. Bruh. I don't know what you thought you were going to accomplish, but uh, it didn't happen. <laughs> I get a little nervous. I'm looking at the capture right now, and it looks like there's some lag, but I look, I'll look i look back at the video later, and that lag won't be there. I don't know. I guess it's OBS being silly. Anywho. Let's see. What else we got here? Nope, just a cast. Oh, nope. We got another one. Ooh. Well, well, well. Ah, trip back to world one, I see. Well, we don't uh, don't really need that. Not quite sure why that was there. Is that like a shortcut? You just find it and skip to world five if you know it's there. The golden train level, that level's fun. This takes us back here. Okay, then we'll do the we'll do the golden train level. So this is a bonus level. I don't know what triggers it to respawn, but like once you use it, it's like gone. But it does respawn later. Let's try to get all the coins. All the money. Ow. Hey. Your quad? The purpose of this level was not for me to take damage, it was for me to get money. And I ended up taking damage and getting money. So much money. Dude. Yeah, money train. <laughs> Hang on, wait, I gotta click the button. Yeah. If I remember, that'll make a good thumbnail. <laughs> and it ends with a slot machine. Oh god, it's the boomerang.
Oh yeah, triple sevens. That's what I'm talking about. Woo! Nice. Probably got like 15 lives from that whole level. Oh, that was awesome. Okay. But, uh, I think we're going to go ahead and wrap up this episode here. That's our in little introduction to World 5. We'll start World 5-1 in the next video. Thank you everybody so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like and let me know. Leave a comment, let me know what you're thinking about this game so far. Let me know if I've missed any like special secrets or anything so far. I'm not really looking for them. So if there's anything I missed, uh, let me know. Unfortunately, this whole thing's pre-recorded. <laughs> but, I I just let just, uh... I'd like to know in case I ever come back to play this game again. And I, and I enjoy the, uh, I enjoy knowing the, learning the little things from you guys. So anyway, thank you guys again so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video.